Remy and welcome back to my channel. Today I am really excited about this video because I am partnering up with Tresemme and I'm gonna show you guys a get ready with me for spring. So today I'm switching up my routine and I'm excited to share with you guys, so let's get started. So today I started off my routine by taking a shower, got in there, washed my hair, washed my face, washed my body, you guys know the drill. Except this time I did one of those things in reverse. So trust me, just launched their new Beautiful line, which is really awesome, and here's the cool part, it's a reverse wash hair care system. You condition first, which gives you softness, and then you shampoo to wash away weight. Super easy, right? Also, there's a one and a two on the bottle, so you'll never get it mixed up. The system is specifically designed to work in reverse, so you can't just do this with whatever shampoo and conditioner you guys have at home. Once I'm out of the shower, obviously my hair is wet, so I'm just gonna go ahead and brush through that to get all the tangles out. There's also a hair maximizer and a mousse in the line that you guys can use to get extra volume if you want it. But don't worry, your hair will still feel soft. So today, I'm gonna use the hair maximizer, and all you have to do is just use a little bit and apply that from root to tip, and that will add volume while also giving you a soft and smooth look. So for today, for my hair, I'm going to go for more loose curls, which is perfect for the springtime, something very effortless. I usually have really tight curls in my hair, so it's really nice and it elongates the hair and I love the look of these, but I thought that I would switch it up and add some cute little braids for the springtime while still keeping the volume. So for this look, I'm gonna use a larger curling wand than I normally use just because that is gonna give a softer wave and I wanna take larger sections so that they're not super tight and curly and also if you leave the ends out, it looks a lot more natural and casual which is the look that I'm going for this springtime. And now that my hair is done, I'm just gonna finish it off with the new Beautiful Volume Hairspray. Next up is makeup. I'm usually one who likes to do darker and bronzy smoky eyes during the winter time, but since now it's spring, I thought I would mix it up and add some more pinky toned shadows in there, something like a mauve and some rosy tones because I think they're really cute for the spring. I first started off with some primer because I want my foundation to stay on all day long and to mix it up, I actually used an illuminating primer which adds a lot more glowiness to the skin, which is what I'm going for in the springtime. Next up, I used some foundation and I just put this onto my duo fiber brush and just stippled that all over my skin and blended it in to cover up all my acne scarring and even out my skin tone. And then I even went in with a little bit more later just to act as a concealer. After foundation and concealer, I went ahead and put some under eye concealer underneath my eyes because I haven't been sleeping very much lately, so I need to cover up those dark circles and I just blended that in with the same brush. After all of that was done, I just went ahead and took some powder and a powder brush and just put this all over my skin to keep my oily skin matte throughout the day. Next, I moved on to eyes and I started off with an eyeshadow base and I just put this all over my eyes and this primer is gonna keep my shadows on all day long and keep it from getting oily and creasing and all those yucky things. Next, I moved on to Cream Shadow, and I have been obsessed with Cream Shadow lately. I think they're so pretty, and they're really sparkly, and I just put them on my eyes to keep my shadows on longer, and it makes your eyes look even bigger. Then I moved on to eyeshadow, and I started off with this really pretty pinky, shimmery, berry color all over my lids. I don't exactly know how to explain it, but it's really pretty for the springtime. It has some really pretty like pink reflex in it, which I love. And after I put it all over my lids, I wanna make sure to blend it out because nobody likes harsh lines, so I'm just blending that out with a big fluffy brush. Once that was done, I went ahead and took a little blending brush and put a dark matte berry color in the crease just to define the eyes and make them pop. Then I moved on to liner. I just used a black liquid liner and did my normal everyday cat eye that I always Always do. Then I moved on to brows and I just took my brow pencil and filled in my brows like I do every single day. <laughs> After that, I switched it up and added some lashes. I normally just go for some mascara, but I have been loving the whole lash look lately. I think it makes my eyes look bigger and I just feel really pretty when I put them on. So I just put those on and they're nice and wispy and kind of more natural looking, I guess. After my lashes were on, I went ahead and took my mascara and just put that on my lower lashes and I meshed my real lashes with my fake lashes. And then I moved on to contour. I have been contouring a lot lately since it's been so trendy lately but I just took a little brush and popped it in the contours of my cheeks just to make my face look a little bit slimmer. And I finished off the cheeks with some highlighter, which has been another favorite thing of mine lately. It's so pretty. I just used this champagne shimmery color on the tops of my cheekbones to make my face look nice and glowy and gorgeous for the springtime. Then I finished up the whole look with just some pink gloss, which is perfect for spring and it's not sticky, which is amazing because I hate sticky gloss and it also smells like vanilla, which is great. <music> And now moving on to my outfit, I am wearing this really cute little t-shirt dress, which I have been loving t-shirt dresses lately because they're really easy to throw on and just go out the door. So I'm wearing that dress with some sneakers, which has also been my go-to. I love white sneakers because they match with absolutely everything. In the wintertime, we tend to wear darker colors and things that aren't as exciting, but I love springtime because I can break out all the florals and the patterns and especially the colors because I love color and that's why I wore this really cute blue dress today. 
And to finish the look, I just added on a cute little blue statement necklace to match the dress. I love a good statement necklace because it really adds a lot to the look and it's really easy to just throw on and go out the door. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. You guys should definitely reverse your routine with Tresemme. I tried it and I love it. I can swear by it. It's amazing. And I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Bye.